Good morning, good morning, good morning. Good morning. Okay. We're going to do a daily energy give or take a day or two, guys. Give or take a day or two. Yesterday was the Ten of Cups, which is awesome sauce. Okay, that means great energy. That means happy go lucky. Have a good day. Smiles on the face. That type of stuff. You know? I mean, I woke up happy. I woke up late. I woke up so late today. I think I literally threw the same clothes on as yesterday. Besides my pajama pants. To be honest with you. <laughs> but look at I'm happy. I'm happy. I'm happy go lucky. Okay? So, right now, <clears throat> you're not with somebody. Alright? But in your hat, okay? In your hat, you laugh. Alright? In your hat, you want to recapture what this is. So, what this is telling me, you're basically, you, you, you're dreaming about somebody. You're dreaming about good old times. You're dreaming, and some of you, it, it's not even anyone in particular. It's just remembering what it was like to, to be happy again in life. All right, letting your letting your spirit shine again, you know the the inner kid having fun, <clears throat> which is great, which is whoa, which is awesome sauce. It's just awesome sauce. I'll tell you that. Oh, there was that ten after that shuffle, stuck to the table, stuck to the point where I wanted to pick it up. So any boozy. Give it take a day or two. Give it take a day or two. You got that king of water. You got that king of water. Holding on to you or holding on to thoughts. Holding on to something that to honestly is is no good. Or or holding on to the thoughts that he's got over here towards somebody. Okay. And it's it's the it's the youth card with the ten of pent. So now we got two youth cards. This is exactly what somebody is doing to the T. So I don't think you're with this person. They're holding on to they're holding on to thoughts of you. Or you're holding on to thoughts of somebody. Um it's like good thoughts, solid thoughts, thinking about the household, thinking about the possibilities, um, Kind of like the fool, he's taking a rest. He or she definitely wants something solid. So they definitely see potential. They definitely see family life. They can definitely picture themselves living with you. Because the Ten of Pence, guys, it's, it's not just, I mean, it's something solid. I think this person before was slick. Someone had to have grown. Whether it's you or this person, it's, it's not a bad thing. It just shows growth. But this king, <clears throat> this king's holding on to someone tight, whether it's you or this person. <clears throat> Holding on to thoughts, memories is what it is. Images in their head of certain moments. And, and some of them are intimate moments. And intimate as in very intimate and just kind of like holding your hands, having a moment or, or sexual intimacy, okay? Um...
This person's having solid thoughts. Tell me about this king. Tell me about this king. Bring love is on. Okay. Death and rebirth. So there's been some some growth. New ideas, new awakenings. Oh, look at the frog. Like I said, thoughts. It, it that's it's just what that is. Okay, dreaming, dream state, um, good memories, moments, more or less. It's more moments, like eclipses of of moments. What about the youth? Abundance. That's that happy. That's that happy, happy. But it took a while to get this happy, happy. This is also somebody who wants that happy, happy that doesn't necessarily have it. So what this is telling me is that this person's going on a journey, some, something with the, the inner knowledge. Okay. They, they know, they know, I don't know what they know, but they know they're not happy because this abundance card. I mean, look at her, him or her, you know, he knows he's not happy. So he's going to take a journey, whether it's to meet up with somebody or not. But this person just knows that they want and deserve something more solid in their life, something that's long term, total cap and Saturn energy. And there you go, the journey twice. And they're off. And they're off. Where are they off to? I don't know. They're going to let destiny lead. So, whether it's you or this other person, these are, are beautiful thoughts. I don't see any, you know, these are action cards, but. It's great that they're having great thoughts, which will only lead them on their journey, whether, no matter where they go, you know, it's, it's one of those things that no matter where they go, they're seeking contentment. Sorry, I'm just over here like, it's that, it's that ton of cups, guys. Let me be the one. All right, so I feel like this one has a lot to say. Someone's watching. It doesn't even want to go back in there. It doesn't even want to sit in there, right? Let's see if we can get another quick one. Maybe a different scenario. Maybe a different scenario. Guys, that can simply be you going on a journey. And it, it you know, it, it's thoughts of things you did as a child. Maybe you traveled a lot. Maybe, you know, like, I don't, I'm not necessarily sure. It looks like thoughts of, of somebody else, obviously, but. I mean, you can really place that anywhere in your life, okay? So, so let's see if we're going to get another scenario. And then I got to get to work. 
jump in the shower, get to work. That night of cups. Dun 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 the new love author is the newbie. We got a freshie on the board. We got a freshie on the board. But this freshie looks like they like to drink, too. Okay. We got the hermit. We got the hermit. So I don't know if drinking has stopped a relationship, some type of stability. Um... This hermit's smart, though. If if there is a drinking issue, I will tell you this hermit knows better. Because they're like, ah, shit. It's still someone new. Some of you is a drinker. Or you, you met somebody when you were out drinking. And now you're like, damn, who is this person to me? Because there's feels here. Ten of pens right there. We got some feels on the board. We got some feels on the board. This is starting new, okay? Um, leaving something behind. Page of Wands is really usually a, a enthusiastic about going places, but this one's just kind of like, damn. Like inside, they have the inner knowing, but they're putzing, and they're not that happy. Now we got the Ten of Cups at the bottom of the deck. I mean, not that happy, ladies and gents. Like they're leaving somebody behind but they they know better i don't know what happened here whomever you're gonna meet because this is the new love offer somebody somebody found uh, this is what that is somebody soul search somebody did <sighs> someone learned something and they know they have to leave something behind and move forward and it's hard for them so if you're if you're able to meet and uh, bump into a new person or somebody from the past comes back, they're they're not in the best shape. They might have a slight drinking issue too. Tell me about this Knight of Cups. So they had a towel moment and they left. Okay. Like I said, this person does not, if you could see, if you could, I wish I put the other camera in. Okay, they're on a journey, they're going. Look at him looking at the hermit. Like, he, like, put the drink down. Put the drink down, if that's the case. Okay, or they're just drinking water, okay, because they're thirsty. Dehydrated from all the crying, all right? But, like, put it down. And you know you did, but there's somebody, this is going on a journey. They're usually a lot more happier, but there's somebody in the background. They had to leave a situation, okay? Um, they had to leave someone behind. I mean, that other person could have been a drinking buddy and was like, I, you know, I, I just, I know, I know this is a, a no good scenario. Friendship, lover, it doesn't matter. It was a no good, all right? They definitely had a tower moment, and they, they left. They got on the boat, and they left, okay? Um, and they just got they just got to land. So I don't know if they, they were on the boat drinking together, and then next thing you know, they split. They get into an argument. They split. Could be like that, too, okay? Because this one's not really waiting. Looks like it might be the same person, you know. So that's that's a that's a finito. All right, the comma. 
you could be dealing with a, a, a strong Libra uh, Virgo uh, Scorpio right now, but that's, remember, you got all pencils in your chat, ladies and gents. But that right there is just, that's karma. They knew. They knew they were in a no good scenario. So this is kind of like, tell me about the page of wands. This kind of resonates with last night's a little bit with somebody leaving a situation. And it looks like it took place. All right, the emperor. So, again, I want this one too. Not too happy. Yeah, see? And yeah, that's that's a wrap. They left something to have something new. But that is okay, guys. Whoever this situation is for, because it, it's good, especially if you're done drinking, especially if you're done in a relationship that was no good. You could have been in a relationship for a very long time, too, even possible marriage. But you got Aries and all the fixed signs here, too. But it was no good. You had you had to you had to walk away. You made you really did make the right decision. The the universe definitely interfered and played part though. Okay, making sure that you did soul search, making sure that you cleared up karma. You you went about it the right way. So it looks like karma was cleared between this and this other person. So that's one less thing to worry about. That's a beautiful thing because the door wasn't left open. So congratulations. Because this was a, a solid break. This is the way you break away from things if you need to. Right here is a harsh lesson. And it's also a Sagittarian lesson. But regardless of that, I'm proud of this scenario because it was done the right way. The door was not left open. There's nothing to go back to. Things were hashed out. Karma's cleared up. You don't have to repeat this lesson ever again. Because you know better now. See what I'm saying? It's beautiful. You chose not to invest time in it. I think you were hoping it would come back around, but there is one too many times. There's a one too many chances scenario here. This was a... It probably wasn't the best break, but it was a clean break. So congratulations. Go towards what it is that's going to make you happy again and today is some awesome sauce energy to, to really get that going because when you shut that door within so much time that new opportunity is, is going to peek around the corner okay um let me just clarify the world because it, it is the end of something so i want to see if it's the end of something well it definitely is but i want to see what's at the end of or what it is you going to it's going to be one or the other all right and it's the Queen of Swords. So you definitely don't tell this person doesn't tolerate no bullshit. But I think it's like you're done. You know, I extended my hands, I'm done. I'm not dealing with bullshit. I'm not looking backwards. I'm moving forward. This person could possibly be extending their hand to somebody else too. Okay. But I'm not too worried about it. To leave a situation like that too is yeah it's mind over matter, well mind over your hat type thing. But that it seems to be a good thing, a wise choice. Queen of Swords or King of Swords, regardless, makes very wise choices, very logical, practical decisions. Okay, they're kind of looking up at the ethers now and saying, okay, you guided me this far. What's next? But you might need to like really put some thought into consideration in that too, because they can't do all the work for you. They helped you get out of this, and you did it properly. They, you, you, this, you had to partake in this. They didn't do all the work. Okay, so they're getting you through the hard part. You know, starting new sometimes it is hard too. But that again, that's on you. Get creative. Go with your heart. It's time to follow your heart now on what really makes you happy. You know there's been growth. You're looking up at the butterfly, too. You know what's the right thing to do. And you're wearing red slippers. So you're golden. You're golden. Okay. See? You're good. You're good. You're good. I love you guys. Have a fantastic day. I'll be back later, Gators. Bye.